And good evening to all of you. That breaking news involving more layoffs at Xerox and Webster, though it's unclear at this point just how many we're talking about. Selena Lewis is in Webster and spoke with the town supervisor. She joins us now live with what she knows at this point. Selena. Well, Adam, we did reach out to Xerox, but have not heard anything back yet. We also spoke to Workers United, who confirmed that there have been layoffs, though they're not sure exactly how many either. They say that there are management positions that have been laid off, and none of them are union positions. We've also seen growing concern on social media this past week, warning that these layoffs were coming. We spoke with supervisor of Webster, Ron Nesbitt, who says he hasn't heard anything from the company either. I've heard from some people that they took voluntary layoffs and they left last week because they knew they were going to be laid off this week. So they went ahead and put in their retirement papers and retired early. Now, again, at this point, we're not sure exactly how many people have been laid off from this facility here. Uh, Xerox has not put out an announcement and we haven't heard back from their PR person at this point. Adam? Selena, thank you. We will continue to follow this story tonight, and we'll have updates on News 8 at 6 and, of course, on RochesterFirst.com.